En este vídeo vamos a explicar de forma sencilla y muy básica cómo elaborar la mayoría de esquemas de camuflaje que podemos encontrar en cualquier avión de cualquier época y fuerza aérea. Este tutorial va especialmente dirigido a modelistas con poca o ninguna experiencia en el manejo del aerógrafo. Don't worry, we will explain what it is and most important how to do it in a simple way. Hard edge camouflage. This is a combination of two or more colors that have a clear separation and this is the result of applying it with adhesive tapes or weighted templates that prevent the fusion of colors. It's a very common scheme in Luftwaffe aircrafts of the Second World War. Throughout the whole process we use our favorite Ibris, the Evolution model from the German manufactured Harder and Steinbeck, equipped with a 0.2 mm nozzle. Take as an example the wing of a ME109E. As a basic rule for any kind of camouflage, we always apply the lightest colors first from those that we're going to use. In this case, the RLM02 Grau reference 71044. We eyebrows a thin general lawyer. The amount of flow improver used is a third part regarding to the thinner. In our case, we had three drops of flow improver every 10 drops of thinner. Same amount of color, from 10 to 12 drops. The appropriate rate is 50-60 of paint in relation to the diluent. Now, we must delimit the separation between both colors with the Vallejo masking tape. For its correct placement, we take as a reference the model instructions or any sort of a specialized publication. We move on to the second color, in our case the RLM71 Dunkel Ground, reference 71015. It is paramount that the eyebrows spray at the legible angle with respect to the belt, that is approximately 45 degrees outwards, thereby preventing the paint from accumulating excessively and forming a step when removing it. On the second shade of the camouflage has been applied, we wait half an hour to carefully remove the tape. Nos vemos en el próximo vídeo y sobre todo muchas gracias por vuestra atención.